Do you like Slay the Spire? Do you like dice? Do you like games that are hard to put down? Then this is the game for me. It's Slice and Dice, and it's on Steam now, and it got like a huge update, so I'm going to play it. Uh, some of you may remember my adventures in this game last year. I've streamed a little bit of it, but I got really addicted to the mobile version. And now it's on Steam, which I hope will um, help its visibility, because this game is, is great. And uh, I'll explain it as I go. Uh, I have not spent much time with this version. This is the 3.0 version, and I think I played it for maybe 20 minutes. Uh, so one new thing is music. Which is good. It needed that. Uh, so basically you have rerolls, and you have shields, and you have to fight enemies, right? So this is magic. Uh, we're gonna reroll these dice, so you have a couple different rerolls. This is a multi-attack, and you can see one damage to all enemies. That's really useful. So the rerolls are out, meaning this dice right here, this die, is nothing. Also, I've never seen this class before. Lazy? I don't like it. Uh, so you can see by the yellow that this rat is going to attack the scoundrel, so I'm going to use the defender to defend the scoundrel. So now the scoundrel has three shields, and uh, we're going to use that attack. So they all have minus one health. This is magic, which adds to your pool. And here are some spells. Poke, I don't know about. One damage, cooldown. Okay, so uh, we got burst as well. So we'll use burst on that rat. Um, can't do anything with healing because we're full. So we just gotta take some damage. But yeah, this new version, apparently there's like new effects, there's new classes, there's new enemies, the, the whole thing. There's those like new items. It's like just this massive, massive update. And it being on Steam for the first time is quite nice. Um, so here's the first upgrade. I'm gonna get the Ranger. Yeah, the Scoundrel kind of sucks, to be honest, so Ranger would be good. And uh, some of those attacks are multi-attacks. It's got a cleave, so it hits both sides of the target. This is ranged, this one, so, um... There's a- there's a- it's, there's some complexity, and again, I'm not, like, trying to be a tutorial here, necessarily, but I am happy to show you why this game has been... Oh my god, I'm gonna get my ass handed to me here. Burst can also be used like a shield, so we've just saved the healer from dying. But I will say we just got, uh... Unfortunately, that was a bad turn. But range, so this archer is back a row, so ranged is the only thing that can really attack that. Um, there you go, save the healer. Okay, we're gonna use that, so the archer is dead. Burst and attack, and that goblin has a white flag, which means it flees when other enemies are dead. So now we get an item. Big shield. Uh, let's do a random tier one item. Bone charm. No HP penalty when defeated. That's not terrible. So I'll give it to the mage. Just in case mage dies. go. Okay, so we're going to save Lazy here. I'm going to poke. Uh, I can't poke an archer. Alright, uh, we'll help. Mend is set a hero to 5 HP, so that's, uh, okay, that, I see what that is. Alright. 
that's not recover 5 HP, that's just set a hero to 5 HP, so that I could actually do more harm than good, if you have a class with high HP. There we go, there's the good one. Perfect. You recover all HP after a match, after a fight. Um, but that's only if your character hasn't died. Alright, uh, Berserker, this Berserker here does damage to himself. Uh, the Guardian, though, has some good stuff. We'll go for the Guardian. Hey, okay, we're gonna have to, uh, figure out how we're gonna do this here. So. We're gonna burst the troll. We're gonna burst its nurse. Doing some really good damage there. So the troll has a cleave spell uh, or attack with this fucking thing, so it does a lot of damage. Uh, but we should be good if we could just get a couple more good rolls. And of course, lazy sucks. All right, we'll we'll burst. There we go. Guardian. Um. No, we don't let the troll escape. The Guardian has come in very handy already. And we don't even need to continue because we got a good thing. Oh, Troll Slayer. I got a, a troll's nose or something. Uh, Terrarium is really good, if I'm not mistaken. Plus one to healing. Replace two right sides with shield two growth. Okay, we'll, we'll get the terrarium, and I'm going to equip that to Lazy to make his class a little bit less shit. at the top. Now we need some shields, for sure. Oop. Just fucked the window size by accident. Don't like that. The game needed a resize function, so I'm glad it's, glad it's here. I've spent, like, way too many hours playing this game when it first came out. And, uh, I unlocked a ton of shit, and now this version, the Steam version, I have none of that shit unlocked. But I'm kind of fine with it. Now it's on Steam, I can play it, I can continue my, my unlocks. Or not continue, but start over and just have them save to Steam, which is much more convenient for me. Um, the Evoker... I like the Evoker class. I'm gonna get plus one pip for each damaged enemy. I'm gonna get the Evoker. Drop an anvil on the goblin. Like an anvil was dropped upon my head. So the Cyclops here, you'll see a, a, in the middle of the health, there's a thing that activates some function. 
Sometimes it can hurt you. Sometimes it can help uh, help them. There we go. Okay. Now you save magic between turns, but there is diminishing returns there. So, like, if you have a fuckload of magic, uh, some of it will go away. That's bad. That was a bad turn. We got three deaths incoming here. Well, now just one, but still not great. I believe that's a stun. Sometimes it, the midway point can help you, even. Shit. Yep, that was a stun. Alright, I need to just do three damage. And there it is. Alright, Lazy has come back, but his, you know, his health is not great right now. Pure heart pendant. Replace the middle side with heal three cleanse. Lead boots. Add sticky. And plus one pip to all sides. Sticky cannot be re-rolled. Huh. I'll try that. On, uh... A class like, yeah, this. That will be good. There's only one chance of failure with the ranger, so, so I think it might be worth it there. This health sucks, by the way, trying to get rid of it. Damn it. Alright. So for this, this one you have to actually, like... Uh... No matter how much damage you do, it only takes away one one armored health. So you have to attack that motherfucker five times. Which, to be fair, isn't as bad as it sounds. Alright, that's good. Because then you can do shit like this. Dead. Okay, Lazy or Fey. The, the Fey is pretty good. I'm gonna get the Fey. We get a new spell, and I'm gonna put Sticky on the Fey, because then you get... Weaken. Target gets minus two to all pips this turn, so this- the Fey with the- this is awesome. I think. Self-heal to allied sides this turn, single cast. Okay. Here's like the first boss battle. Uh, okay. Uh. Damn. Damn. <laughs> That saved us. Barely, but just enough to, uh, to keep people alive. Alright, so that's good. Weaken is good. Do that. Do that. Do that. Perfect. Gonna undo that. There is an undo function. That sucks. All right, it's fine. We got we got two dead people. It's we we got this. It's just I'm worried about a little later now. Plus six mana, future cooldown. 
Oh, that's it. Right, right, right. Okay. Add pain and plus two pips. So pain, you take damage when you use your item. I'm going to learn invest. No idea if this is going to end up being worth it, but we'll see. Uh, that was bad. This militia has a shield. If an enemy I target gets plus five plus shields, I flee. Oh, okay, that's new. Okay. It just didn't seem worth it to use invest. Especially when I could just kill the soldier up top. Okay, so we stun the Slimer, but it, it also means we're, uh, we gotta go another round here. Slimelet must be killed. And we got it. Alright. Finally, we get rid of Lazy. Uh, Collector has a little bit of everything. Gladiator has... is a little more focused. Um, Collector also has one more health. I'm gonna get the Collector. There we go. Now the Guardian is stacked. Copy this into all allied sides this turn. Yeah, that's not that's not right for me right now. Do some bone rattling. Yeah, just the, the skeletons actually hurt enemies next to them when you destroy them, so they're useful to kill first. Two damage growth. growth. Growth gets one pip this fight after use. Right. That's good. Um, but we want a shield for sure. Damn. You may flee. Monocle adds Engage to the middle side. Times 2 verse damage with full HP. That could be good for the Collector, so I'm gonna get it. That. That's a good first roll to get. I 
and we got it. I'm gonna try this. It might be dumb, but... Yeah, it was dumb. Okay. Hmm. Because that, that's not gonna kill the zombie. No way. Uh, it's good, but it's not, like... Probably not worth it. Yeah. Save my magic. There we go, there's one one dead. Times two if I'm dying this turn, right? I just need to do one more damage to the zombie. Love dropping an anvil. Okay, now th now these are level three classes. I don't think I've seen stoic class. Maybe, maybe I have. Venom does poison. This is a uh, poison one damage poison plague. Also inflicts one unblockable damage. Plus one pip for each poison on all characters. So we're gonna, yeah, I'm gonna get the venom. Now we have to fight a lich. Try something here. Save the Fey. That's a lot of bones. That's that's like too many bones. But yeah, upgrading the pitchfork was, was probably the, the best move I could have done there um, at that moment. Come on, get three. Get three. Fuck! All right, all right, all right. Oh, this fucking lich. Alright, the collector's got the death wish thing now, so we'll just use that. I'm going to use poisoning the lich is just too good of an idea. Invest would be nice. I don't know if I want to do it, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it. I'm going to do it. We're going to take a lot of damage here, but having a ton of extra HP uh, in a little while is going to be 
very useful. Let's see, we got uh, MP rather. We got it right here. Six. God damn it, get that skeleton out of here. I'm gonna do it. I wanna- Yeah, there you go! Oh, man, look at that! I just fucking, like... Gave the lich so much poison. That was a really, really surprisingly good play. And I didn't even expect that to happen. Replace the middle side with plus two mana duplicate. Or ghost shield. You know what? I'm going to get the conduit. Let's see if that's any good. Gonna do another investment. Get a ton of magic for this next turn. But uh, we're, we're cutting it pretty close here. Watch this. Save the Fey. What does Circle do again? Self heal to all to allied sides. Does everyone get one? Oh, oh, to their to their. Uh, okay. Okay. You know what? Why invest? No need to invest. We'll just fucking kill. And that will save all of us. Uh, the undo, there, there's like an achievement for doing an entire thing without using undo. Which is obviously very nice, but, you know. It's a little tough. I've tried it. I don't think I've completed completed that. Let's poison the fuck out of that troll. What's this do again? It's the target of the previous dice this turn. Alright, troll will be dead soon. Now you can't escape. Indecisive. Ah, I un use undo 20 times. Okay. There's the Paladin Artificer, which has the, the daggers. I really like that sk uh, skill. Look at that. Uh. I'm gonna give this to the collector for more magic mana. I don't know if that's gonna work out great. And there's like a lot of things. Oh look, it's a clud sword. There's a lot of things that could go wrong with that strategy, but we're gonna try it. Uh, that was a pretty good roll to start. I don't 
don't know. There's a bad, there's a bad uh, thing there. I just wanted to save everybody. Play game without undo button challenge. Level impossible. Music. Two damage. One each charge stored man. Oh, let's try that. Oh, I see. Okay. Turn on auto flee. I didn't even know that was a thing. It's a good item for a character that's missing uh, a dice, a die side. Let's try something here. Take some damage, but these two rocks can die next turn. Oh god, summon an imp. No, don't like that. Okay, bash. It's got a, like a seven damage sword here. Or stalwart, big block. I'm gonna go for big block. We don't really need this anymore. It's good, but it's not like better than what we have already. So, um, that's fine. Mind a nice double poison. What's this do? Self heal. Oh, okay. Huh. Oh, this is a tough decision. I wanted to do a, um, Yeah, that Fae is getting destroyed by the slate. I'm, I'm gonna just do this so that the Fae doesn't die. I wanted to poison the Troll King, but I'll use I'll use the the arrow to get rid of the archer. Oh, they they really don't want that Fae to live.
Okay. Big achievement. I wanted to kill the slate. Alright, Faye's dying. That's alright, we'll kill the slate next turn and hopefully I can still survive. Can do. Troll is not going to get poisoned unless I have a really good poison. Uh. And now we're poisoned. Um, I'm going to save the collector since the Artificer is out of a lot of magic. There we go, good roll. Sickle, plus one pip to all lowest pip sides. Hell yeah. Oh, the Fey is fucking diesel now. I don't even know why I said diesel, but yeah. Hell yeah. That, that's... This character is now like a class 3, like a tier 3 character. Just because of two items. Uh, we still have to figure out how to make them live. is poisoned, which is normally a bad thing, but in this game it is a good thing. Very nice. A shaman, or shaman, or a curator. I'm gonna go for the curator. It's another variety weapon class, but I think, um... More useful, even. Plus two mana. Mana. Uh. I was using the wrong thing there. I meant to use this. Did I? Yeah, you know what? Yeah. Let's, let's, let's do that. Okay. Growth. We don't need that. Alright. Let's see. getting this fucking sword. 
You get one mana if you use the sword. want the Fae to live. Alright, I mean, it's the undo feature feels a little cheesy, but in a game like this, it's very useful. So, I'm gonna use it. But, yeah, I don't, I don't want my characters dying. Save the artificer. Ah, uh, it sucks. Fuck it, we're gonna go big sword. Worth it. Very good. Second heart. Plus one HP for each one HP. Huh. This side could be used again if it saves a hero. That's good too, but I'm gonna... Hmm. idea here. Right. Watch this. Oh, it's a basilisk. Can't do it again. Ah, oh, shit. All right. Take out the basilisk immediately. Can be reused if it was lethal. Well, it's not going to work on the basilisk, so I'm just going to grow the magic. We just have to fight the Hydra. I 
Okay. Some decent poison. Final class. Um, profit is good for healing. Rescue. Um, profit. We lose these these heal boosts though. These, these are really good. That's a salve. This is a soothe. You know, what? I'm gonna get the profit. sticky again. I don't know if I want to. Uh, having the choice would be nice, I think, but... Uh, we're gonna get rid of the sticky. Alright, here we go. Fighting a dragon now. I hope I made the right choice by getting rid of that. Invest. Okay. That's a lot of damage. Big poison. That is going to be good. Generation here. He's in enough turn. And uh, Dragon is mega poisoned. So if I could double that poison, like in Slay the Spire, the catalyst move, that would be great. Uh, question is, do I want to go for broke here? Because everyone's going to die. I don't, I don't have a good answer for that right now. Dragon dead! Did it! Got one! It was my first win on the Steam version. Hell yeah. Not much of a speed run, is it? Alright, let's just never look at that again. Okay, cool. New cool mode unlocked. Choose party mode. 
So yeah, there's a, a fuckload of unlock unlockables. Uh, 14 of 133 achievements. There's some secrets. Um, here's all the hero classes. I don't even know what green is. Any 50... 50 achievements are needed to get green. Tons of monsters, tons of items. I, I love this game, and it's just gotten better and better and better. So, let's do another one. I'm just gonna take a minute, and I will be back. Uh, you'll, I'll just pause it. You won't even know. Stay tuned for another run. And back. Crappy. Crappy modes? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's interesting. That's new. I'm just gonna do another normal run. Uh, what have I done here? Oops. No. What are you doing? What you do? I want a different team composition. That's weird. What's going on here? Well, I most certainly don't want to continue this run. Uh, I wanted to do... Uh... Did I find a glitch? You know what? I'll try it. I'll give it a shot. You know, I had the basic team composition last time, so maybe, maybe there's something to this. This is new, too. You know, I haven't seen this. How uh, different uh, team compositions play out, like, you know, two orange, two red. I want to unlock green classes. That's all new, I think. At least it's been new since I've played. Remember, I was playing this <coughs> before Tears of the Kingdom came out. And then I just played a ton of Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, Rogue. Definitely Rogue. Those purple daggers are amazing. They can also be kind of annoying, because if an enemy has thorns, you got yourself a problem. But when you roll and it lands on it, it does one damage. You don't even have to use it. Bad decisions. I, I my brain was elsewhere for a moment. No valid targets. Really? Stun an enemy with equal or less HP. Targeted ally cannot die this turn. It's pretty early to get that. Like, usually classes later on have that, so... Starting with that is quite interesting. Plus one empty mana... Uh, max HP, plus one max stored mana. That's, that's pretty good. That has utility... ...later on as well. Like, that, that could be used... ...much more... Whereas some early items just get replaced. But yeah, there it goes. Now you can see that activate.
if you get like a bunch of those cantrip sides, it's stupidly powerful. Heal to regenerate. Pray. Heal and shield one to all dying allies. Heals one to all out. Ooh, the priestess is really good. The priestess. Problem is we don't really have offensive magic. to the rightmost side. That is another one that's useful more... like, it scales well. Because, again, these early items are usually... by the end, you just don't have much use for them, but... that that's a good one. Slime lit entirely. The slime lineage ends here, motherfucker. <laughs> so aggressive to slimes. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, the juggler. That's what's up. What's this? One self damage can trip. Uh. All right. That's new. New to me. At least the juggler has a lot of HP. Just in case you land on that garbage. But man, that is so fucking good. Poison's really good against rocks, weirdly. Which is not something you would, you know, s assume. Really good turn, that. Harpoon. Yeah. Target takes plus one damage from dice and abilities this turn. Uh, Clover is pretty... situational. And can be amazing, but I'm gonna get a Harpoon. Plus... We're going to put growth on that, and I think that'll be a really good side for someone who doesn't have a right side. Because I'm Mr. Right Side. <laughs> Rusty Jokers. Why would I do that again? I thought for sure this has got something else that can happen. Now, if, if you can replace that with a different um, side, like, like what I got last run, the juggler would be, like, phenomenal. I'm going to get the armor, I think. 
Yeah, we'll get the armor. Which also means... Yeah, it's fine. It's amazing how the music... it You know, it's very basic. Just adds so much, though. Especially considering the uh, original did not have tunes. Th this, the armor can upgrade a, a weapon to make it better, as you're seeing right there. And that's really good for poison, because that, that's basically like four damage, two to four. Poison is excellent. Ex very excellente in this game. That, this can only attack the target with the highest HP. This move. This is, um, heavy damage. Upgrading the cantrips would also be nice, too. chances of free damage. Like right there. Brilliant. There you go. Splitting arrows. That just fixed the juggler. Now there's no more shitty side. Uh, I'm going to get the harpoon, but I'm also going to grow this also grow that uh, there's 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 potential here for that leaf that's, that's a really that's a really good item to get early on well, not even early on just in general but like again it lasts zombie. I found it's, it's good to focus your attention on one enemy at a time. Weakened. All sides reduced. That sucks. Again. I'm going to go for the vampire this time. Yeah, vampire will be good because we need more attacks. Two healers in a party is, is cool. I don't think I've ever really done that before, but I do feel like attacks, short attacks would be nice. move is excellent. I 
Because I can save everybody. I mean, it's not the most powerful, but it also don't, it only costs one mana, so it's so... It's so cost-effective. It's so, it's so, like... It's like a no-brainer to use. Simplicity. One pip to all basic heal, mana, damage, and shield sides. That's also really good. Plus three max HP, plus six empty max HP. Huh. We have basic sides. Uh, got some. I could get that and hope it gets better later. I'm gonna do that. Really, I can only... Right now, it only does one thing. I mean, it helps the vampire. So it's good. It's not, not bad by any means, but I do think if we get a class that's a little bit more basic, it's gonna be very, very good, as opposed to just good. Fanatic will die. Oof. They, yeah, they want to kill that armor. Just clicked out of the game by accident. Wizard. And he's back row, so I can't really do very much. That can happen, though. Alright, Poet. Oh, jeez. Poet or Assassin. Assassin's looking pretty good right now. I don't know what the fuck is going on with this poet. Shields, cantrip shields. Charged. Clink. Target gets plus one to all pips this turn. Oh, we're going, we're going poet. We are going poet. Much more specialized, but the potential. There's the potential. Endless options for renewal. Love that cantrip so much. Holy fuck. Rotten. When I fought that rotten creation, Douglas. My birthright. You. Douglas, on my birth birthright. You are the lease on our guide, Douglas. If only I had one more mana. Unlock something. That's awesome. Oh, wow, I should have used that earlier. Jeez, I didn't even realize that was that powerful. Look at that. 
That is mental. That's so Oh my god. That move is amazing. Add mana gain to all sides with exactly one pip. At the start of each turn, self-shield two. Self-shield is good, but I'm going to get the... The thing with the mana side, especially for a character like this. Because that's just free mana. If it, if it rolls correctly. Save the Priestess. You know what? We'll use that. Uh, yeah, we'll use that. Save the Priestess. Might have done that incorrectly. No, we're, we're, we're good. I mean, yeah, I, I, it was, I basically lost one extra HP on the Priestess, but I think it's okay. It's free mana. What's this one again? Shield 2 to all allies. I, I'm going to take that. I mean, it's always good. Burst is just useful. So even if you have, like, I have all healers, basically, Burst is still great. What a, what a team. I'm gonna go for the Witch. Yeah, we'll get, we'll get the witch. Which has a variety of options. That's insane. Win a fight on the first turn. <laughs> Replace all sides with single-use mana sides. Oh, that's that's a little too much. Replace the rightmost side with shield one to all eyes all allies can trip. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and that'll now generate mana because it's on the rogue. So that is fucking masterful. I didn't think this team was going to survive, and it turns out it's, like, broken now. I say, probably will also die at some point. That's all right. Answer. Uh, yeah. That's as close to the... Well... 
What is it, this one? Spell rescue. Yeah, we'll, we'll get the dancer. It's close enough to the rogue. trip mana sides too which is very very good oh that's so fucking good then ooh Kill the topmost enemy. Oh, so yeah, that there's no way to. There's just no way to live, huh? All right, well, fuck you then. damage there. Tusk. Plus one pip to all heal self-heal sides. And one shield as well. Plus one pip to all mana, mana gain sides. I like that one. Hmm. I, I don't like this one as much as I thought I did. thought it was better. Well, we get cantrip mana too. That's, that's not terrible. If it happens. Oh, fuck. Yeah, they have spikes. Well, there you go. See, there, there's something. Um, already have four mana. That's, that's a fucking insane amount of mana just for free. Ironclad. Just unlocked a new thing. That's that's the good shit right there. Zombie, you may as well just run. Zombie doesn't want to run. Alright. The, the mana gain is, is very, very nice. Uh, Fencer. Double Blades. Profit. Uh, heal one to all allies. Regenerate. Heal and rescue. You know, I kind of want the Fencer. But I'm going to get the Profit. Because I have an idea. Actually, no, I didn't have an idea at all. Eh. This egg is now useless. Well, it's getting some use, I guess. We'll see. That might have been an, a fine choice, but uh, right now it doesn't feel like it. Oh god, the, the basilisks are taking away our... Uh,
our uh, good sides here. I think magic is the way to go for the basilisks, because otherwise they're just gonna fucking take away all of our good moves, which is already happening. Control will be easy, at least, on its own. Angel Feather, add rescue to top and bottom, or second heart. I'm gonna go for the random. Shiny Gauntlets, add pristine to the top and bottom sides. Times two if I have full HP. keep the dancer healed if we're going to use this rock. Oh, that's awesome. It already worked. And it's working great. that wizard. Immune? Ugh. Wait, why'd that go down so quickly? Five damage in a turn equals in is death. Okay. Sleeve. Okay, Ludus. Ludus is gonna make use of that thing so we're gonna we're gonna use this we, we lose a couple things here but we got a growth and I can increase with the egg so that all of these do one extra damage which is good yeah yep that's it here we go final fight That's what I wanted to do.
It's obviously not always the dragon. There's a lot of different bosses, but I'm just... I got the dragon twice in a row, it seems. Okay. Okay. That archer has to go. Big chump. There we go. There we go! I wonder if you can regenerate two health. Oh, okay, nice. Wasn't even sure I could do that. Just fuck it, regenerate three health. Taking zero damage from this dude. No, you're not escaping. <laughs> no. You dare deprive me of this? Five minutes or less. Blessed ring. Only one death, and it was a forced one. Yeah, I'm number 258. New cool mode unlocked. Loot. No level ups. Loot after each fight. Plus one item slot. Max four. This mode is difficult. I think I played this previously. But yeah, th this is Slice and Dice. Um, high recommendation. You can lose a lot of hours, which maybe you don't want, but I do. Well, not always, but... You know. Yeah, I, I fucking love it. So anyway, thank you for watching. It's Slice and Dice. Sorry, I was just checking my phone. I will play this again sometime, and... Um, this in Balatro, we eaten good lately, friends. I'll see you later.